Well, Aiden, a uh, tough battle, but uh, it pulled out a three. How do you feel right now? Pretty good. I mean, earlier in the week uh, in the duels, I think I won like 18 to 7. I mean, I think there I won a little, or I was started a little slow. I mean, gave up a first takedown. It was a good, good shot or go behind. I forgot what it was by him, but I mean, I thought it was a good match. Kept kept fighting through it. I mean, he didn't stop wrestling and that's why I ended up the score it did. I mean, if I stopped wrestling, I probably wouldn't have had such a high scoring match or he might have won if I didn't stop or if I didn't start wrestling. But I mean, just grinded it out. I mean, it's a long week, tough week. I mean, sore, tired, buys a little beat, but I mean, it's what you got to do to takes what it takes to get done. I mean, so. Yeah. Eight. Eight matches in four days is, is, a, is a lot. Yeah. So, so um, how does it feel to have your final match as a high schooler go out uh, go out with a the other state title? I mean, that was my last match as a Go Hawk. I mean, bummer. I mean, I love this team. It's something special. Over these last four years, I mean, I don't think I would have wanted to be on any other team. But I mean, what about the sport of the guys that? Hey, your seat. I saw you hugging on, on waiting for you coming back here with some some of the guys. Uh, what, what was it like to, to be with this team? It's pretty special. I mean, everyone's like, we were trying to figure out how to beat Polk here with the team race. I mean, I don't think it could have been done. We all needed to pin our guys. but And they then, all needed to lose. Yeah. But then Nate ended up getting that pin, so it was kind of out of reach. But we were all trying to figure out and try our best to get the pin. But... I mean, we couldn't do it, so I mean, fighting to get second here. I don't know if we're in second or third right now, but just trying to keep the team race alive and get as high, climb up on that ladder as high as we can, and I mean, go out with go out with a bang, I guess. So, you know, I think McRae's got a got a Northwest guy against him, so that might help you guys out get, to take that second place. Yeah, I think Jake has the Northwest guy, but yeah, that that should help if, if we get that win there. I'm hoping. I think Jake can pull through. So. Mm -hmm. Should be fun. Should be a fun few fi final matches here. This is a uh, back-to-back undefeated state championship season for you. Yep. Four-time state medalist, three times in the finals. What do you hope people remember about your high school? Um, not that I was a great wrestler or just like a good, solid wrestler. I mean, I mean that's cool to be remembered by if I am or not, but or a tough wrestler. But I just hope everyone remembers my name for just being Aiden. I mean, I think I'm a pretty special person. I bring a different kind of feel to wrestling, different, uh, I don't know, some different emotions. Different energy. Different energy to wrestling. I mean, I feel like a lot of people are serious going out there. I mean, it is serious. It's it's business. You got to take care of it. But I feel like that's when you're on the mat, when the match, when the first whistle starts. But, I mean, I, I feel like being loose and having fun with your teammates, having fun with the crowd and stuff is what brings a special place, makes it a special place because then everyone's together, your fans want to, your fans will remember you by that, how much you care about them, showing them love, so I mean I'm always trying to give our fans some love, so I mean they're pretty, they're pretty special too, always out here supporting, we got a huge fan base here supporting down in Des Moines, and there's always a big crowd at home, so, and wherever we go really, so I mean that's pretty special about Waverly too, so I'll always miss that. There was a hug after the match between you and Martinson. You guys are going to be yep. teammates at Iowa. Just talk about the, uh, I guess, the respect that you guys have for each other as, yeah. as competitors. I mean, we train at Siebel together. We're, we're friends. So, I mean, it's not like we're going out there and trying to diss on each other. I mean, we're obviously wanting to beat each other because we're out there wrestling each other. And our teams are pretty pretty competitive. Sep and Waverly, I mean, we're always racing for the team title. We got the past few years, they beat us in duels my freshman and sophomore year. But I mean, we're, it's all love after the match is over, after the tournament's over. So I mean, you always got to show respect to them because we'll be teammates making each other better here in the future. I'm excited for that. Jess Rogas, Martinsons, all of them will be joining here. And I think we can create something special. So. so reflect a little bit on your four years at WSR as a, as a wrestler and as, and as a student athlete, uh, as a, a, a member of the Go Hawk, uh, uh, Go Hawk team. Um, everyone at Wavewood cares about the sport of wrestling. I mean, we care about all sports, but I mean, 
wrestling's pretty. Thank you. I mean, wrestling's pretty special. Our teachers talk about it all the time. Like we'll be in class and we'll be having conversations. They'll tell you good job in the hallways after a dual meet. Like it's all it's all we talk about at Waverly. We're always wanting to win state, do good at national stuff, and we're always talking about wrestling. So it's a pretty special place to have wrestling, I think. And our our community is amazing. We're always like there's this one restaurant called Joe's Nighthawk. And they always got like the fight night. Yep. And they always got letters outside, like saying that there's like home duels and stuff, and like we we call them wing dings. Mm -hmm. So after like districts and stuff, we'll go there and we'll we'll hang out and eat and stuff. So I mean, I think it's a pretty special community. Waverly's a special place to be. Being at Waverly, you have super high expectations. You know, you're top ranked, but you know, you come through on those on those expectations tonight. What does that feel like to do that? It's pretty amazing. I mean, Iowa's a special place for wrestling in general. I mean, we got Iowa, U and I, Iowa State, all these colleges in the state. So, I mean, always, always fighting to. I mean, Waverly, you do have high expectations, but it's what makes us Waverly, I guess. I mean, Whit coming to Meyer here, always t pushing us to be our best. All the coaches are pushing us to be our best. And, I mean, shout out to Schwabi, he's probably the best driver we have. I mean, we always get to roll down the windows and roll up to black and her back in black. So I mean pretty special place I think. What's your excitement for next year at Iowa? Oh I'm pumped. I mean I'm gonna be able to grow as a wrestler, as a student and as a person in general. I mean I'm almost eighteen so I mean growing into a man from there, I mean growing into an adult and I'm excited to see how far I go there and just how good I can become as a wrestler and see what I can do to carry on like a legacy or be remembered by there. So hopefully, I, I'm, I'm just pumped. Thanks. Uh, yeah, no problem.